This is Duke University. Today we're going to be making gold nanoparticles. Here we have our gold salt solution dissolved in water and it's stirring on a hot plate. And attached to the round bottom flask we have a condenser. And through this condenser we are flowing cold water so that when the water which is being heated evaporates uh, into the condenser it reaches a cooler temperature and then is condensed back into the solution. This way we don't lose any volume of water and all of the concentrations of our reactants stay consistent throughout the reaction. Now since we're at our target temperature we're going to add our reducing agent which is also our stabilizer. Its role as a stabilizer is to protect the surface of the nanoparticles after they're formed and keep them from aggregating or sticking to each other. Its role as a reducing agent is to reduce gold ions into gold atoms. So now we'll add the reducing agent and as the solution goes from yellow to colorless that is when the reduction of the gold ions is occurring. Now once the gold atoms that have been reduced supersaturate the solution they will start to stick to each other forming nucleation sites. As more and more gold atoms stick, they grow into the gold nanoparticles. This is happening now where we see the color turn from a dark blue to a purple to a wine red color, which is characteristic of gold nanoparticles. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.